Coco Golf versus Iga Swiatek as the first semi-final for the ladies event in Dubai for 2023. And both ladies have similar roads to get to the semi-finals. Goff entered the tournament as the number five seed and we get a bye in the first round. In the second round, she take on Sasnovich, who had just come off a three set epic in her first round. And this was no problem for Goff, winning in straight sets, six love, six four. In the third round, she was put up against the number nine seed, Rabakina, who had come off two very impressive wins. But unfortunately, Rabakina had to withdraw due to a back injury, handing off a walkover into the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinal stage, she would take on the unseated Keys, who had taken out Azarenka and Garcia along the way. But Keys hit too many errors, and Goff would get the straight sets win, 6-2, 7-5, to make it into the semifinals. Fiontek entered the tournament as the number one seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, she'd take on Fernandez, who had had a very good first round, but unfortunately it was too much, and Fiontek would get through in straights, 6-1, 6-1. In the third round, she'd take on the 14th seed, Samsonova, who had battled past Bedosa in the first round and gotten a walkover in the second. But the walkover in the second didn't give Samson over any hope as Fiontech smoked her 6-1-6 love to get to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Fiontech was supposed to play Pliskova, who was coming off a good win against Zachary along the way. But unfortunately, Pliskova got ill as Fiontech continued her run, making it to the semifinals with a walkover. These two players have played five times before, with Fiontech winning all five matches in straight sets, and they played four times last year, including the French Open final, with Fiontech winning every match super easy. If Goff's gonna win this one, she needs to serve well, and she needs to limit the errors. Even though she played well, or well, the score suggests she played well against Keys, Keys hit over 50 errors, Fiontech's not gonna give that many free points away. And Goff also hit 30 errors, despite winning in straight sets, so she needs to limit the errors, and of course, serve extremely well. If Fiontech's gonna win, she just needs to keep doing what she's doing. She's beaten everybody in the last couple of weeks super easy, and she's not gonna be scared of Goff. She's beaten Goff super easy in their past matches too. So I'm a little worried for Goff in this one. This is gonna be an interesting match. We've seen this match so many times, and it's played out pretty much the same way every single time, and I think it's gonna do the same again. I think Shriontek's gonna get the win in straight sets. I hope that Goff makes it competitive, but I can't see Goff making it more competitive because of that error-filled match she just played. Uh, against Keys, so I'm gonna go with Fiontech in straight sets, but you tell me, who do you think is gonna win this match?